What's up, Still Mace Warriors? Coach Victoria Islas from StillMaceWarrior.com. And today, I'm gonna to share with you a very simple tip. It's not gonna to take too long to talk about it. If you are feeling unmotivated with your Still Mace training at home, let's get into that right now. So before we get started, I would totally appreciate it if you subscribe to this channel. And if you like this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up because that will help me out. Now let's get into the topic of feeling unmotivated at home with your steel mace. Because as you know, several gyms are closed and sadly several uh, gyms have closed down, um, including uh, my sister-in-law's uh, gym, she closed that down and now she's just doing like online uh, fitness training. She's doing one-on-ones in her private studio now. So I have seen how much COVID has affected gym owners and how much it has affected you guys. Um, you know, people just want to, you know, train and get back to where they were because I know damn well that I'm not where I was a couple months ago. I mean, I've seen, uh, you know, a lot of top Instagram influencers who have even got COVID and they're going through um, a lot of struggles with their training. So I just want to point out that you are not the only one struggling with motivation, struggling with getting back to where you were and, and stuff like that. Okay. So don't feel alone. We've, we're, we're all there. So let's get into uh, motivation. So motivation um, to me and in, in my mind and how I've learned about it, um, it's very short lived, okay? Motivation happens like when you first start your diet, right, your diet, when you first start your training program and you're feeling super pumped and you're motivated, but somewhere down the line, whether it's a couple of weeks or a couple of months, you start to feel very unmotivated. And that's because motivation isn't everything. So what ends up happening when we don't have motivation anymore is now we have to kind of work a little differently here, which is actually the way we should have started off with, at least the mindset you should have started off with, where rather than to think that motivation was gonna be like the single most important thing on your journey. Cause I myself have seen myself yo-yo up and down, up and down, up and down when it comes to trying to tackle everything with just motivation. So what is the solution when you lose motivation? And the answer to that is action. So let's just say, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make up a, you know, a story here. Let's say that you were consistent for three months, but all of a sudden you plateaued or you, know, you started to feel unmotivated and you stopped completely. And now you're like maybe a month in, maybe two weeks in and you haven't really gone to your still mace and picked it up and, and done your thing, right? Uh, you're feeling a little bit like you gained some weight or, and maybe you're just feeling like just off, okay? Because you were, you were doing so well for three months. Okay, so now it's time to take action and all you have to do is take five minute actions or 10 minute actions to start off with, okay? So what that means is if it's spot still mace training, all you gotta do is get your ass up and do five minutes of training, okay? Now, obviously you gotta warm up and cool down and stuff like that, but it's five minutes, okay? So get up, pick up your mace, do it for five minutes. Then, if that seems pretty easy for you, okay, let's say you're doing this for a couple days and you're like, okay, fuck it, I got the five minutes down, then start to go up to 10 minutes. So now you're like, okay, I got the five minutes down, I'm gonna start doing 10 minute uh, training sessions with my still mace. And at some point you're gonna go 20 and then you're gonna go 30 and then you might even get to 45 minutes. But if you're feeling unmotivated, the thing is to take action, to get off the couch, to get off the bed, to stop watching Netflix, okay? Or, or Disney Plus because The Mandalorian came out and you're watching the first season and now you're jumping into the second season. I know that Unfortunately, I've done that before and I'm watching Mandalorian now. I probably shouldn't have brought that up in this video, but I had to because I'm a Mandalorian fan. But anyways, all right, so get off of Netflix, get off of Disney Plus, you know, put the child on pause and pick up your still mace. Do five minutes to begin with. Move up to 10 minutes, then move up to 20, then do your 30, all right? So it's all about getting back into action and getting back into those good habits that you formed three months ago. It's so simple that you, you might resist to do it. So it's all about breaking through. And this is just a tip 
that I give to you from personal experience. The best coaches, hands down, are the ones who have been through it and that pass on that knowledge, okay? Um, no fucking coach on the planet is perfect. We've been through it, okay? And I'm telling you that this works if you implement it and you start working on it, all right? Anyways, I hope this helps you out. Don't forget to subscribe, to uh, like this video if you enjoyed it and found it helpful, and leave a comment below. Tell me, do you think that this very, very simple tip is going to help you get motivated again for so much training? Have you ever tried it before? Comment below, let me know. I am out, and may the universe always flow with you.